Going in here, phase three. A triple team. You want to try and shock these joys as quick as you can. Get tough taunting as fast as you can. Get Papa team going as fast as you can. Try and get this done in two turns. I mean, in one turn. Some fact, I don't activate this taunt. Maybe until three or four joys are shocked. And with RNG, I stunned this guy here so he doesn't use his ability. And do some crazy damage on me. I need Palpatine. There we go. So shock's gone. Speed down. Wow, that sucks. Usually, you could get it. I could get a Palpatine. I could usually get these joy shock. All by turn 14 with Papa King. This turn was 13. And uh, just keep shooting away. The only one you want attacking is Papa Team. Get some defense up on you guys. Get some facts halting. This is a turn meter glitch that freezes everything. Like all the joys from going, it keeps them from going. It keeps the tank in the background from going. Palpatine is the fastest guy on the board right now. Good thing with Palpatine, you might you want to have uh, all potency mods on them, and hopefully some of them uh, have crit chance and crit damage on them. Triangle, you want crit damage, or crit chance, depending on what you're lacking. So if you have a lot of good crit chance on them. Potisimas, then I will put crit damage triangle. But if you need crit chance a little higher, you can go with crit, crit, uh, crit chance. And if you uh, got good crit chance, do crit damage. Speed down doesn't want to land on a B2 here. Now, the only thing you want to do from Palpatine is basics, since all these droids could die off for one shot. You don't want some fat getting back at them. That's why you save the taunts. You don't want some fat getting back on them when they're low. Also here, you don't want to use this speed up because you don't want the tank the tanks to go again. The taunts are limited by their by their turns. Get some health up on Han. Hopefully, he gets some health back. But I think that's due to turns also. So that was pretty much. Pointless. <laughs> Get sword trooper hunters and uh. Uh oh. Somebody on Discord. Yeah, these is. I'm making this for these, my guys in uh. Trainers Corners. So you can have a visual of how it is, more or less. From a. Uh, you know, player's perspective. I know there's a bunch of videos out there, but. Here you can see my routine and how I do it. Um, I don't have airplane mode on, and I'm lucky enough that it worked good enough that I don't need it this time around. I usually do. I can't do it with the video. I'm making a video. I'm on my phone doing this. I'm pretty getting good damage. I started around 79.91. And I got it down to 75. That's already 4% damage with this team. Now, I might get a couple more turns in depending on his counter. Alright, RG got some health back. Let's get some health back. And defense up, reduce that damage. Seventy-five. So right now, I started at seventy-nine, ninety-one, point ninety-one. I got at seventy-five. So I already knocked down four point nine. I mean, yeah, four point ninety-one. Right here is five percent. Can change. 
Now, I'll probably survive one attack he does. Or maybe two. Alright, RNG's smiling upon me. Usually I, I do one hit and he counters right away and that's it. And then, this is, uh, that's it. <laughs> I do this, kill everybody. Tank goes and kills Chirpo and me, or uh, Pop Team. Damn, now they're back. Now I won't be lucky enough to stun them all, so. 7426. So that right there puts me at. <laughs> 5.65% damage. Now once I get a better speed on Palp, he'll be able to get more shocks on the droids in the beginning. This ain't too bad. And Sword Trooper, if I get Sword Trooper in there to replenish health, it'll go a lot farther too. So for you guys who can get Sword Trooper, I would advise it. 